This morning I want to say to you something. When I entered here, uh, we were together for the, 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 the first, first movement was the Holy Eucharist. And during, uh, uh, after, immediately after the Holy Eucharist, I was attracted by the Virgin Mary to look here, the Virgin of Fatima. And uh, she was surrounding this place this morning. She was surrounding this place with her presence. And uh, I was so much, and uh, I can see all the light around the statue of the Virgin Mary here. The statue of Our Lady of Fatima. Fatima is really important in the world. Fatima, La Salette, Hakita, uh, and Medjugorje. I went to Medjugorje. First, I didn't believe in, in, in Medjugorje. I'm honest with you. Because, you know, it was a long time ago. Well, it was in 80, I think, 80. You know, yeah, but my non believing was in <laughs> 80, 83, I think. So, when was the war in, the, in Croatia? Ninety-one. 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 Ninety-one.
and also how we keep this land alive. It's by the Word of God, because we know the Word of Jesus, and when we know the Word of Jesus, our life, you know, become more, I would say, more spy, you know, when you have bubble in, in the... Sparkling? Sparkling, yeah. <laughs> Who said that? <laughs> ah. Yeah, when we have the Word in our heart, you know, our life becomes sparkling. Sparkling because the Word of God is Jesus Himself. He is the Word who, take flesh, who took flesh from the Virgin Mary. So He enlightened our day and He sparked, you know, all our life by the, the grace that He gave to us. And the Word of God is really important. It's so important, you know, that I know. Imagine, I can know something. <laughs> but I will be not alone now. You will know also, because I will share that with you. You know, I know that when you enter in purgatory, you will read the, the Bible. Because it's a purification, the Word of God. And the people who have never opened their Bible on earth, they will open it in purgatory, I assure you. <laughs> But the difference between the word that you will, you know, read in purgatory and the one you hear from here, it's uh, the word of purification. It means that you will feel the importance of this word by the flame who will enlighten you and in the same time purify you from the, the sin and what has to be purified before to enter in heaven. And this is why... The second thing asked by the Virgin Mary is to read and pray with the Word of God. The third one she asked, and this is one, it's an important, you always see that during the retreat, is the confession of sin. You know, Jesus said, if you ask something against your brother or your sister, don't go immediately in front of the altar and say, Lord, look, I am nice. <laughs> Because you will see your spot, you know, <laughs> of sin. And uh, you will not be able to say, I am nice. Huh? So, Jesus said, if you have something against your neighbor, let your offering there. Go and reconcile. And after that, come and present your offering to the Lord. When we approach Jesus, we approach Jesus with our heart our life, our need, but in the same time, what he asks from us. He doesn't ask, you know, big thing. No. He has just one thing. Come with a pure heart. Come with a heart of humility. If you have something against your brother, go give him the pardon. Don't try to Excuse you in, in from everything. Be honest with yourself. Come to me with a pure heart. And you know, my, my children, you have the possibility to cleanse your heart through the sacraments of penance. It's, somebody said to me, it's so hard, Father. I said, good. <laughs> I said, why? I said, because, you know, this is the resistance of the devil who make this hard. If it's hard, it's because now you will be free from the chain of the devil, from the link of the sin, from the bound of the sin. You know, some people sometimes, no, our sin is like, you know, elastic, an elastic, you kill them all, the, the the fly with a rubber, you know. Rubber Ping! Rubber. <laughs> <laughs> you know, some some people have that in, the, in their soul, you know, and uh, when they try to, Ping! they come back on the same thing. <laughs> because you know, the bound of the elastic pin have to be cut, and this is what the priests often, fathers, we often forget in our confessional. By the authority of the name of Jesus, I cut the bound and I cut the link mm -hmm. between your past, the people, the situation, what you saw in your memory. I cut all the link and the bound from your sin, 
from the past, and now I can give the the absolution. This is really important to do it, you know, because you will no have rebound. Bing, you know, <laughs> you will be free to walk as the virgin today who walked for the door. You know, when the bridegroom will open the door and said, "Come, my people." Love your neighbor as I have loved you. And this is really important. Today we have the first part of this. Love your neighbor. But they forget as I have loved you. And now they transform it. They love on each other. You know, it's no more the commandments of the Lord. So we have to be ready acute of the meaning of the Word of God. And when we have this Word in our heart, it's easy to see the spot of our sin who touch our soul. You know, St. John Mary Vianney, the great saint, the curé d'Ars, was describing the sin of the people like a, a spot of oil, you know, on the soul. And this is what he was describing because it's really dark. And it's not easy to cast out this thing. Have you ever tried to wash the oil, you know? Partially the motor oil. The guy knows that very well. Right? You try and you try and it's always extended. This is the sin. When you try by your own power, you will not be able to clean it. You will extend the thing, but not clean it. So, how to be ready it's by the confession the sacrament of confession it's more than a bleach it's more than you know a soap who washed the, the the soap it's more than that it's the powerful love of god who come and touch the soul and clean it in a way that the devil cannot remember your sin he erase your sin and he erase the memory of the devil also so you become like a real Jesus on earth. Because this is our mission. And this is the way to be the bride of Christ as the church. And also has a privilege. People who were chosen by him to present the powerful love of our Father to humanity. Who want to save his children. Confession. The third one asked by the Virgin Mary. You remember that? What, what is the first? Prayer. 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 <laughs> the second one? <laughs> Mixed up here. Bible. Read the Bible. The third? You're good. <laughs> Lord, everything is done almost now. <laughs> But the last one was said by the Virgin Mary is fasting. This is really important. This four pillar was revealed, you know, through the, the intervention of the Virgin Mary throughout the apparition, but was compared in a certain way by Our Lady of Peace in Medjugorje. You know, the last one, the fasting. It's really important, and particularly during this time. Because the fasting pull out, cast out, destroy the work of the devil. Jesus said to his apostle, some devil has to be cast out only by fasting and prayer. This is why the Virgin Mary asked us today to fast. Why? Because, you know, if you look the world now, Everything is upside down, you know, and everything is mixed up, you know. We have no more scale of value, you have no more confessing of God exists, and now the people are doing every kind of stuff who is not belonging to Him. They kill their children. They kill now the elder. They kill the ones who are not, are not according to their frame perfection. of perfection. They kill, you know the one who have some infirmities. This is terrible. And plus, they live like beasts. 
It's amazing. We can see that everywhere. Now, have you noticed how many tattoos goes around? Yeah. Now it's going around, you know. <laughs> it's uh, some. Uh, I noticed that one. You know, a young lady who work in a, a small, uh, you know, place where you buy food in our area. She start with a tattoo on the knee, here. The ankle. Uh, huh? ankle. Ankle. Yeah. And uh, now she has tattoo here, you know. <laughs> And the last time I saw her, she had tattoo there and there. I said, wow, <laughs> these things are growing. <laughs> it's true. Have you noticed that? These things are extending. And you look at the tattoo, or they are ugly, you know, or they are looking as the, you know what the fish have on their Scale. Scale. It, it's weird. Huh? <laughs> so when we are looking that, we say, wow, something is going on in this world. But how can we be delivered from this spirit of pestilence who goes around, who attract, you know, who attract the people? Only by fasting. This is important. And this is why the Virgin Mary said, fasting. You're so good. You know now everything. So you can be the warrior of the Lord. 